Hold on to your seats, folks, because this is a big one. Picture this. By the year 2023, China had filed over 100,000 patents in artificial intelligence. Yes, you heard it right, 100,000. That's more than the combined total of the United States, Japan, South Korea, and the European Union. Talk about a startling leap in technology. Now you might be wondering, how did China manage to pull this off? The answer lies in a combination of massive investment in AI by the Chinese government, a large pool of talented engineers, and a regulatory environment that, for better or worse, allows for rapid development and deployment of AI technologies. Compare that to the United States, which has long been seen as the global leader in tech innovation. Recent years, however, have seen the US grappling with regulatory challenges, privacy concerns, and a lack of cohesive national strategy on AI. Meanwhile, China has been making strides, implementing AI in everything from facial recognition to predictive policing and autonomous warfare. But it's not just the US that needs to be looking over its shoulder. The European Union, despite its robust digital economy, has been slow to adapt to the AI revolution, hampered by strict data protection laws and a fragmented digital market. Japan and South Korea, while pioneering in robotics and automation, are still playing catch-up in the AI field. Now, this is not to paint a picture of doom and gloom. Quite the contrary, it's important to recognize that competition can spur innovation. Countries like the United States, Japan and the European Union have immense technological capabilities and the potential to make significant advancements in AI. But here's the thing. It's not just about who is leading now, it's about who will lead in the future. And right now, all signs are pointing to China. The question is, how will the rest of the world respond? This is where you come in. What are your thoughts on China's AI dominance? Do you see it as a threat or an opportunity? Are there lessons to be learned from China's approach to AI development? The comments section is open, and we'd love to hear your insights and perspectives on this. So go ahead, join the conversation. Until we meet again, future eye explorers, stay safe and curious.